great. That looks magic. Right, let's do it. Cool. Good. Okay, we're going to start off by settling in this lovely space. I'm going to do a little breathing practice and then a little bit of stretching and then we're going to go and cool off in there. Okay, take my glasses off. Okay, first of all, you're going to really connect with your sitting bones into the ground. So feel your sitting bones settling down in the ground. Hands can be here, yeah, in lap, wherever feels comfortable, down on the ground, whatever feels good. And then you might like to close your eyes just to take a few minutes to uh, just settle into this space and start to feel a really lovely sense of length coming all the way up your spine, up to your crown. And then we're going to start to take a few breaths and invite that lovely long breath into this space to really help us ground into the moment. So take a really nice big breath in. So in through the nostrils, but you're going to feel your belly stretch. So sometimes it can help to bring your hands onto the belly. And you take a big breath in. And then exhale out through the mouth. And again, so just keep this going. So we're just connecting with this nice uh, ebb and flow of breath, these kind of waves of breath coming in and out of the body. So take another big breath in, inhale, really feel your belly stretch as you breathe in. And then exhale, feel the shoulders roll down the back of the body, but feel this length all the way through the spine. So you're still sitting up nice and tall, really nice, Simon, great. And again, take another breath in, inhale, stretch through the belly. Exhale, bring your awareness to your belly button and you're drawing your belly button back towards your um, spine. So you're really pulling the navel back in towards the spine. So we're really engaging through the belly here, switching on the abdominals. <sighs> Drop the shoulders a little bit, nice. Inhale, big breath in to the count of four. Inhale, one, two, three, four. Exhale, out through the mouth, let something go. And again, inhale, breathing in. Exhale, out through the mouth. And again, keep this going. So we're just really beginning to allow ourselves to settle into this space to kind of draw a line between what has gone on in the day so far so that we can land into this space and start to connect with the breath so that we feel really grounded, quite calm but also energize at the same time. So keep this lovely wave of breath going. So you're inhaling in through the nostrils. You feel the belly lift and rise. And then you exhale out through the mouth or you can keep the lips sealed and you can breathe back out through the nostrils. And we're really beginning to lift that energy all the way from the pelvic floor right up to the crown. So we keep this lovely sense of um, activation through the spine. Exhale. And now bring your left hand onto your heart space, so somewhere onto the chest, right hand onto the belly. So we're gonna move into three part breathing. So we're gonna really work to isolate the breath in different areas, lifting it eventually up to the heart space. So we're gonna start off by breathing into the right hand. So you feel the belly lift, but you're really isolating it to this area. So inhale, bring that breath into the belly and then exhale, belly pulls back. And again, inhale, nice, exhale. Super, really good job. And again, breathing in, exhale. So now we let the breath creep a little bit higher. We start to fix expansion through the ribs, especially the side of the body through the front. So again, take the breath in and feel the, so the breath comes into the belly. So you feel the belly expand first of all, and then it's like you lift the breath up a little bit higher. So inhale in, keep that breath coming in. One, two, three, four. Exhale, four, three, two, one. And again, inhale, one, two, three, four. Exhale, four, three, two, one. So really bring your awareness to kind of almost expanding here through the side of the body. And again, inhale, one, two, three, 
four. Great job. Four, three, two, one. <sighs> Great. This time we bring the breath up a little bit higher. So the breath comes in through the nostrils, but we feel the belly. We let it creep up, expanding through the rib cage, lifting it all the way up to the heart space. So inhale through the belly. You can close down the eyes if that feels good. Take a nice big breath. I'll do this one with you. Inhale. Exhale. And again, bring the breath in. So we're really looking to create that balance, that steadiness and ease, and the inhalation and the exhalation is nicely balanced. So we inhale to the count of four, inhaling, bring the breath right up to the heart space, so right up to your left hand. Inhale. Keep the shoulders down the back of the body. Find that softening as you exhale and again back in, isolating into the belly, then let the breath expand, creeping up into the rib cage, really nice, up into the chest. Feel that length through the spine, into the crown, and then exhale all the way back out, down through the rib cage, through the belly. Let go of that breath, really nice. Release the hands, take them down either side, sweep the arms all the way up, big breath in. Exhale all the way back down. Nice. And again, inhale. If the shoulders feel tight, you can keep your arms like this, nice and wide, so you've got a big ball, or you can bring the palms close together. Take a breath in. Exhale all the way back down. Really nice. And again, inhale, lift up through the spine. Exhale, release the arms all the way down. Nice your hands onto shoulders you're going to pull your elbows together here as much as you can so they may meet they may be here and then we're going to look to lift the elbows up and we're going to release all the way through the shoulder blades so here as your shoulder as your elbow come back feel your shoulder blades drawing together behind you and then inhale lift up exhale squeeze the scapula together nice inhale keep it going exhale inhale lift up all the way through the spine pulling through the belly exhale nice and again inhale exhale this time take the arms nice and wide we're going to reach around behind see if you can grab a hold of the hands here so they may meet they may not meet how are you doing there yeah and then draw your hands away so i'm going to just move around so you can see from a different position so the hands come here and they draw away from the body so you get this really nice external rotation through your shoulders how does that feel good take a breath in really get engaged here activate through the belly inhale and then exhale release the hands and let them float up they should feel quite nice and light sweep them all the way up gaze up towards the palms and then exhale bring the hands all the way around and behind you and then rest your hands down onto the ground, nice. And then here we're looking to open up through the chest again. So we're lifting that energy into the space. So how does that feel? You can maybe place your hands on blocks if you feel like you need a little bit more height. So sometimes it's quite nice to lift the ground up to you a little bit more. Yeah, that's great. And then here, drop the shoulders and see, yeah, exactly that. You've got just the adjustment. Keep drawing the shoulder blades together here. So imagine you are gripping a pencil in between the shoulder blades. Really nice, Simon. Opening up through the chest space. Keep breathing, maybe just gently tucking in the chin so it's in line with the breastbone. Really lovely. Breathe, big breath in. And then sigh the breath out. Breathe through the jaw again. Inhale. Exhale out through the mouth, release through the jaw. How are you feeling? Good. Your right hand down into the ground again. So you could use the block here or onto the ground. Reach your left arm all the way up. Yeah, nice. And then here, we're going to take a bend over to the right. So you're going to go the opposite way. You're going to go that way. Great. So you inhale to lift up, so really stretching all the way up to the fingertips. Exhale over to the side. So we're 
up through the flanks, the side of the body here. Nice, really great. And then maybe with your chin, you can just gently lift it and gaze up towards the fingers. Beautiful, nice. Keep breathing, squeeze the shoulder blades together, keep grounding down into your sitting bones. Keep that breath coming in and out of the body. And then we windmill the arms all the way over. So grab your other block, left hand goes down, lifting up through your right arm. Feel that nice stretch into the armpit, right up into the fingertips. Inhale, pull in through the belly, exhale over to the left. So you might notice that one side feels a bit tighter than the other. Sometimes it can feel quite sticky in the hip space. Great. Make sure you're breathing into this space. Inhale. We're going back over the other side. So windmilling the arms, right arm down. Inhale, lift up. Exhale, over we go. So opening up through the side of the body here. Maybe you find a little bit of movement back and forth here, just bending through the elbow. Yeah, really lovely. Got great flexibility through the side of the body there. All the way up, left hand down, reaching up with the right, over to the other side, super. Inhale, lifting up a little bit. Exhale, floating down as much as it feels comfortable. And then bring the arms all the way back. Nice, take the arms out nice and wide. And then from here, we're gonna wrap the arms all the way around you're giving yourself a big hug and you're looking to bring the fingertips together i don't know anybody that can actually do that <laughs> might be weird but it's that sense of really pulling your fingertips towards each other and then drop the shoulders down nice pulling through the core feel the belly activate inhale exhale release arms out nice and wide nice other side opposite on top. Same thing, feel the fingertips creeping around behind the back. Nice big breath in. Nice big breath out. Pull the shoulders away from the ears, drawing through the belly. Navel drawing back towards the spine. Great. And then release the hands all the way down. Super. Let's bring the hands back into the lap. Maybe one palm on top of the other. Bring the chin in gently towards the chest and just feel this lovely stretch through the back of the neck. Stay here for a couple of breaths. So we're just finding that softening, that ease, preparing for our dip. Let's take a few more deep belly breaths. So we're going to inhale, breathing in. Exhale out through the mouth. Keep this going, inhale, bring the breath into the nostrils, nice long breath. Exhale out through the mouth. And again, keep this going, maybe close down the eyes. Notice this softening, this ease that's coming into the body. Maybe there is a sense of feeling uh, more kind of controlled, more calm since you started to practice. Yeah. that long deep breath now sometimes it can be at the beginning of a practice so this is obviously a really short swift flow today just to warm us up a little bit I'm not sure that we need it <laughs> we're both sweating in, but just a little short to open up through the back shoulders ready for us to have a little bit of a swim so now I think we're ready for the dip <laughs> let's do it wait. Come on then, let's just get in. I'll do it your way today, all right? We're just going for it. Are you going straight under? Oh my God! Okay. I reckon I might not go completely under that either. Good job. Nice. Oh, it feels amazing. Did you notice a difference from the other day? Definitely. I feel much more prepared and just Bit more grounded and ready for it. Yeah. Yeah. Super. Right, you're going to do it. You're going yeah. to do a loop. Let's do a loop. Which way are we going? This we're going way? to go that way. We're okay. going to go around that boy. Magic. I'll race you. <laughs> I'll hold on to your leg. <laughs> you can just go for it if you want to, because I know I'm a bit slow. Oh, 
can't thank Simon enough for bringing me down here today. It's such a magical spot. There are so many dragonflies buzzing around on top of the lake. It's just gorgeous. I had a great morning. So wonderful to practice some uh, yoga with Simon before our swim together. It was really the perfect nourishing morning.